Alright guys, so after careful consideration, I think I've made my decision. So, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get a PlayStation 5. Now, I know a lot of people are gonna be like, Hey, you have, you have an Xbox Series X, you have a Nintendo Switch OLED, you just unboxed the Switch OLED um, later or earlier this year. Um, and yes, I know, I am very well aware of that, but I also considered everything that the PlayStation has to offer as well. So I think I'm going to have to get one anyway, because one, I want to play the new Spider-Man game that's out, the Spider-Man 2 game or whatever, and it's only accessible through the PlayStation due to it being an exclusive game for the PlayStation 5. So that's why I think I'm going to be getting it. And once I do get it, I'm going to basically do a... I'm going to be doing just like I did with my Xbox Series X, like I did with my Nintendo Switch OLED. I'm going to be doing an unboxing video, and I think I'm going to go ahead and might as well, um, since I'm going to be putting these videos together, you guys will be seeing uh, different clips put together. I think I'm also going to record myself going in and then going out of the store, by basically buying it. So yeah, I want to document it for y'all because that's what I love to do when I do these unboxing videos. I like to do that. <laughs> Unfortunately, I was not able to with the Xbox Series X when I got it because it was too big. Um, I wasn't going to do it with the Switch OLED. I didn't bring my phone with me that day. Um, but this time I'm going to bring my phone with me and we are going to be experiencing my very first purchase of the PlayStation 5. Now I have not, now keep in mind, I have not owned a PlayStation since the PS2. Yeah, let that, let that sink in for a little bit. <laughs> um, but yeah, so that's what this video is going to entail. Um, we're going to get the PlayStation 5 today. Um, and I'm also going to be recording it and at least try to record uh, me going in the store and then coming back out of the store with the PlayStation 5. So yeah, because I just want to I just want to bring something new uh, to the channel and this and these unboxing videos, they get a lot of views. Um, and my last one that I did with the Nintendo Switch OLED, that one got a lot of views and the Xbox Series X one got a lot of views. So yeah, I'm hoping this one gets a lot of views. I hope we can crack a lot of views with this. So, um, yeah, <laughs> anyway, um, let's go ahead and get the PS5, shall we? Let's do it. I'm ready, dude. I've been ready for a minute to get this shit. <laughs> Um, let's hope that this first store that we go to has it. Um, I don't know if they're going to have it or not, but we will see what happens in the video. So anyway, I'll see you guys when I am walking into the store going to buy it because yeah, <laughs> this is going to be a historic day because like I said, I have not owned a PlayStation since the PS2, which was a very, a very long time ago. <laughs> I think it was like eight or nine when I had my PlayStation 2. Which I don't even know where the fuck it is. <laughs> fucking, I don't even know. <laughs> fucking, it, might, it might be back in that closet somewhere. I don't even know. <laughs> um, but anyway, um, hope you guys enjoy this video and hope you guys enjoy the unboxing on here um, because that's what I usually do whenever I get a brand new console. I like doing it. It's basically a milestone for me and a milestone for everyone on this channel to celebrate because, yeah. <laughs> um, yeah. Yeah, it's my hard-earned money, and I'm putting it to a good use, and, uh, yeah, so anyway, um, yeah, I'll see you guys when we go and get the PlayStation. Oh, we're about to get that new PlayStation 5. <laughs> we're about to get it, dude, and we're going to unbox it here very soon, so, yeah, hopefully they got it in here. We'll see. Finally got my PlayStation. <laughs> I also want to show them the games, too. I got two games. I got Miles Morales. And I got Minecraft for the uh, PlayStation. So yeah, these are the two first games I got. This is the first PlayStation I've had since the PS2. Can you believe that? <laughs> PlayStation 2. Last time I had a PlayStation, it was a PlayStation 2. <laughs> but yeah, we're going to go set this up. We're going to unbox it. And uh, yeah. But, all right, y'all. We about to open up the PlayStation 5, dude. I'm excited for this. <laughs> Look at this. Look at it. Look at this. Look at this beauty, dude. Look at it. It's even got Spider-Man 2 on it. What do you guys know about that shit? I literally got a I literally got a fucking deal on this shit. So yeah. A fucking steal of a deal. As some would say. Um, but yeah, let's go ahead and open this up. I'm gonna unbox it. Um I 
think you open it up from this side, right? Yeah, you open it from this side. And then, let's see. Okay, I'm gonna try to get the camera to uh, view it like this, maybe. Um, I might be actually opening this up wrong. I don't know. Um, I think so. Yeah, I think I gotta flip it back up. Uh, let's flip it around. Yeah, because I don't want all the pieces to fall out. So, yeah, you open it from this like this. And then I think you do it this way. I might be doing it wrong. I don't know. Um, yeah, let's see. Okay, and then you grab this. Okay. I don't know if I, I think I just tore the fucking thing. Okay. Um, yeah, this guy's really huge. Okay, yeah. Oh, there it is. Okay, yeah, there's a little flap underneath it. I don't know if you guys can see. But... Yeah, there's like a little flap underneath there. So you gotta take that out. And I'm assuming you go like this. And boom. Power cord right here. This is the power cord for the PlayStation 5. Um, let me go ahead and unzip tie it. I fucking hate these zip ties. <laughs> but let's go ahead and do that. Um, yeah, I'm not, and now I'm gonna show you guys the setup on it once I get it all set up and everything. But this is just the unboxing portion. You guys should know this by now. Um, with my unboxing videos, um, but yeah, uh, power cord for the PlayStation 5 right here, um, right here, so we're gonna set that up to the side, um, alright, and then, what's, what else, um, oh, so, yeah, the little, oh, yeah, the little stands for it, the, uh, horizontal stands, I still gotta get the vertical stand, uh, because I got the PlayStation Slim, and the slim one, I think I have to order the actual vertical, uh, the vertical stand for it. Um, but yeah, we're going to go ahead and put that there for now. And then I'm going to open these up. Um, so it's got two little flaps right here that you open up. Um, I'm going to show you guys, um, let's just see if I can position it. Um, so yeah, open it up like that and then two little flaps open up and then let's see. Okay, next thing we have here is the DualShock controller for it. Oh my god. Oh my god. Look at that controller, dude. <laughs> dude, it's been so long since I've seen a fucking controller like this. <laughs> yeah, keep in mind, I have not owned a PlayStation since the PlayStation 2. So yeah. This is very cool, though. I like it. I like how it looks. I like how it feels. It feels really good um, in my hand, this uh, new controller. I like it. Um, so, yeah, that's the controller for the PlayStation 5. Let's see. Does it have anything else? Oh, yeah, it does. Okay, yeah. And then we got the HDMI cable right here. Um, and, uh, yeah, and then we're going to just gonna set this aside. You guys already know what HDMI cable is. So, yeah, HDMI cable. Uh, let's see what else. Um, this is a USB cable. I believe this is what you use to charge the controller with. Um, I might be wrong about that, but correct me if I am in the comments, um, of this video, but let's go to here. Okay, there's another flap you gotta open up, and, oh, so yeah. Hold on, let me grab the camera. Let me actually switch the camera around so you guys can see. So the console is literally in here, as you guys can see, it's all wrapped up really good. I think they did pretty good with the packaging on it. Um, I'm going to pull this out and hopefully it works. We're going to see. I'm going to go ahead and set my camera back down though so you guys can see when I pull it out and my first, first initial uh, thoughts and ideas on it. So yeah, just thought I would go ahead and show you guys at this angle. So let's get back into the video, shall we? So moment of truth, we are about to pull out the PlayStation 5 console. And it looks like it's in here, I'm pulling it out. It's almost out. It's like I'm giving birth to a fucking PlayStation, dude. <laughs> uh, but yeah, all jokes aside. Okay, so I have this uh, for the Spider-Man 2 game. It looks like I got a code for it, so I can redeem that later, I guess. Um, and uh, yeah, that's cool. Um, actually, I'm gonna show that show that to you guys. I don't, I don't know if I showed it uh, fully, but there there it is. So. Yeah, just in case the camera didn't get it right. Um, but yeah, we're gonna go ahead and grab this PlayStation out of here. And this thing's this sucker's heavy. Oh my god. Oh, it's like I'm giving a fucking birth to a PlayStation, dude. Uh, let's see if I can actually grab it at this angle. Can I grab it at this angle? I don't know. 
I don't know, but I'm grabbing it anyway. Um, yeah, it's almost out. It's almost out. I just gotta push these flaps back. Um, there we go. So yeah, I like their packaging though. Their packaging is amazing. All right. Um, all right. Here we go, dude. Here we go, dude. We're about to get it out. We're about to get it out. Make history, dude. Look at this. All right, got it. I got it, dude. All right. Now, let me just go ahead and throw these aside. But yeah, I have in my hands here the PlayStation 5. And this is the Slim. Keep in mind, this is not the regular. This is the Slim PlayStation. But it still works as a PlayStation 5. And it still does everything that the PlayStation 5 original does. Um, but this is a little bit better because it's got one terabyte of uh, SSD on it. And uh, yeah, and as you guys can see, um, this is the PlayStation 5 console right here. <laughs> this sucker is actually pretty heavy. <laughs> Look at that, dude. Look at that sleek fucking... Look at the sleekness on it. Like, oh my god. I'm gonna take the tape off of this, though, because... Yeah, you guys know... You guys know me and tape. I don't, I don't like to have, having tape on my shit, so... I'm taking this tape off of it. Um, there we go. Alright, there we go. <laughs> um, but yeah, look at this. Look at this console, dude. Look at it. It's fucking sleek. Um, it's got a disk drive on it. I like consoles that have disk drives on them. Not gonna lie, to each their own, but I like mine have, uh, to have, like, you got, you guys understand it. <laughs> um, but yeah, you can lay this basically vertical, or you can lay it, uh, either way. And I think you actually have to have a vertical stand for this, so I'm gonna eventually get one. Um, but yeah, let's see what other stuff is in the box. Um, so I'm pretty sure there's more stuff to it. Oh yeah, there is, okay. Yeah, just a couple of instruction manuals on how to set it up. Um, you would probably... If, Obviously, you would get this probably if you uh, got a PlayStation like I did. <laughs> but yeah, look at this. Look at this, dude. Look at this fucking beauty, dude. Fucking dude. PlayStation 5. <laughs> My first time getting one. My first time getting one, dude. Like, dude. And the controller, even... Dude. I cannot get over how, how insane this controller is compared to my Xbox controller. Let's see it. Let's let's see the comparison. Let's see the comparison. I, I really want to compare this. Okay. So yeah, they're about the same size, but I think this one's got more of like a grip on it. Um the Xbox has a little bit has like the the things on the back for a better grip. Um but I think the PlayStation 5 has a pretty good uh sleek looking uh I think that's pretty much the way you can describe a PlayStation 5 is it looking sleek like look at this dude <laughs> it's sleek as fuck dude this is insane i cannot wait to set this up dude um it's got a couple of usb ports in the back um it's got a uh lan connection thing so if you want to connect it to your router directly so you can uh, play your games on it that's cool it's got a couple of uh usb c things on the front of it that's very cool and then it's got like a little uh power button in front of it i like how it looks though i like how it looks um the playstation 5 definitely um i would put this up with the xbox i would i would run this up with the xbox because yeah um granted the xbox doesn't have a lot of uh games that this has like for example i got this so i can play spider-man on it and a few other games that i cannot play on my xbox uh series x um and that's the main reason why i got this anyway um, for those that are wondering, they're, they're probably going to be like, well, why'd you get a PS5 when you already got an Xbox Series X? I know, yes, I asked myself that same question, but I had to get a PlayStation 5 because some of the games that are coming out are not going to be released on the Xbox. And so, yeah, I had to had to give in to Sony, <laughs> get, a, get a PlayStation 5, and I think it's actually going to be pretty good. Um, I might actually be able to stand this up without, even, without it actually... Uh, I think I might be able to stand this up without even needing a uh, vertical stand for it, but I don't know. A lot of people said that I should get a vertical stand for this thing, but I don't think I really do because look, look how, look how, look how sturdy the bottom is. Look how sturdy that bottom is of that. Um, I think it's gonna, I think it's gonna stand up pretty good. I think it's gonna be pretty good. Um, but yeah, PlayStation Five. <laughs> 
what do you guys think about this? What do you guys think about this uh, new console? Do you guys think this is pretty good? Do you guys think this is a pretty good purchase? Let me know down in the comments. And uh, yeah, I'm going to set this bad boy up. And I will show you guys on my TV once I get it all set up. And it's going to take a little while to set this thing up. But hey, we unboxed it. We got all the fucking cords and cables we need for it. Um, so yeah, that's going to take a little bit. But now I'm going to show you guys uh, the final product of it being uh, on and everything being set up. So yeah, um, yeah, this, yeah, it shouldn't take too long to set this up. But I'll see you guys when this uh, new console set up and everything. So anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the video. And I'll see you guys um, when this thing is powered up. As you guys can all see, this new PlayStation is powering up pretty good. I'm um, just waiting on it. It's still on the uh, loading screen, as you can see. Um, but yeah, look, it's powered up. It's ready to go. It's ready to game. And uh, yeah, so hope you guys enjoyed the video.